Hi everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Ashley and I will be guiding you through an energizing flow today. All you need is yourself, your mat, and a nice amount of space to move around. We're gonna start in a comfortable seated position. So you can sit cross-legged, full or half lotus, or if you wanna sit on any props, hands can rest, palms up, palms down. Let your eyes close, sit tall, melt through your shoulders, and just tune your attention into your breath. Every breath in, can you get a little bit longer through your torso, extending out through your crown? Every exhale, let go of anything that you're holding on to and consciously feel your shoulder blades move down your back. Every breath in, can you get more full and expansive, especially across your collarbones and your energetic heart, allowing that to lift and shine forwards. Every exhale, move more away from your day, your week, your month, or anything that you might be holding on to right now. And as you're starting to feel your way into this moment and into your body, think about what has inspired you to roll out your mats today. I'd like you to set an intention, picking a word, an idea, that you want to shift your awareness and energy to. Try to trust the first sort of nudge that you get. Feeling that word and idea within you and knowing that it already exists there. You're just bringing a little bit of extra light and energy to it today to feel it on a deeper level. As you set your intentions, let them reside in your heart, keeping them close by so you can return to them anytime during your practice if you need that little dose of inspiration. Take two to three more breaths where you are. Take your gaze to the ground, allow the eyes to open. And then starting in your child's pose, take your knees mat distance, bring your big toes to touch and begin to walk the arms forwards as your forehead melts to the mat. Pressing through the palms or even the fingertips. Floating your armpits up as your bum drops back. Breathe into your low back on the inhalations. Soften more and more on the exhalations. Inhale, walk your hands to the right side of the mat. You may come off the mat, left hand reaches higher. Perhaps bend the right elbow and feel a beautiful opening from your left hip to shoulder to fingertips. Inhale back towards center, all the way to the left side. Maybe walk off the mat, right hand reaches higher, perhaps bend the left elbow, now feeling that same opening through your right side hip, to shoulder, to fingertips. Walk your hands back towards the front of the mat. Press into the palms, keep the arms straight. Start to lift the head up looking forwards. The bum comes up, roll over your knees. Heels towards the bum, draw your chest up towards the sky. Take your gaze up, inhale. Exhale back into your child's pose, bum towards your heels. Nice and fluid. Inhale, unravel, come forward, soften your hips, lift your chest, float your heart high. Exhale, back over, bum to heel. Last one, inhale, unravel, come forward, open through your heart. Exhale, and back. 
Inhale, walk your hands towards your knees. I want you to come up so your bum comes down in your heels. Keep your knees about hip distance. Left hand behind you, reach the right arm up and over to the left side, peekaboo over your left shoulder. Right hand down, left arm up, look over your right shoulder. One more on each side, left hand down, right arm up. Perhaps lift your bum up, pelvis forwards. Bum back down, right hand down, left arm up. Option to lift your seat, look over your right shoulder. Beautiful, bum back down. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, hands to the mat, make your way into your tabletop. Tuck the toes, look at the fingertips, spread them wide and even a small micro bend in your elbows. Breathe in and drop the belly. Lift your chest, bum back. Exhale, round your spine, curl your navel in. Inhale, belly down, collarbones up, sitting bones draw back. Exhale, curl, belly button in, gaze to your navel. One more, inhale. And exhale. neutral keep your hips over the knees toes stay tucked walk the hands forwards drop your chest maybe the chin or forehead down into your puppy dog stretch it's too much forehead down or stay a little bit more of a hover keep lifting the sitting bones up to the sky feel that widening or broadening there You're going to walk your hands back into table. Turn your fingertips to the outer edge of the mat. Little bend in the elbow, shift your weight left to right. Move the weight from heel of the hand, knuckles, fingertips back and forth. And pause, fingertips forwards. Left leg extends straight behind you. I want your toes to find the earth first. Draw your heel back. And these little stretch through your calf. And then float your left leg up in line with your hip. Hip bone pointing towards the ground. As you inhale, open your leg to the left so your toes are pointing forwards. Leg is in line with your hip. Exhale, sweep that leg behind you. Inhale, open leg to left. Exhale, bring it back. Last one, inhale, open to the left. Exhale, take it back. Right arm is gonna reach forwards to the front. You can pause and stay here or bend the left knee, right hand reaches for your foot. Kick your foot into your hand, draw your chest forwards. Come back down to all fours, wiggle the hips. Right leg extends straight back, toes find the earth first. Draw your heel back, breathe into your calf. Lift your right leg up, in line with your hip, toes point down. Inhale, open your leg to the right. Exhale, sweep it behind you. Inhale, open to the right. Exhale, back. Last one, inhale. Exhale, back. Left hand reaching forwards. You can stay right here or bend the right knee. Left hand reaches for your foot. Kick your foot into the hand. Open your chest forwards. Focus on the steadiness of your breath as well as your gaze. Come back down to all fours. Wiggle at the hips. Tops of the feet are gonna be heavy. Sit your bum back onto your heels. Interlace the hands behind your back. Draw your fists down. 
shoulders down, gaze up. Forehead to the mat. Arms start to roll up and away from your low back. Option one is here. Option two, crown of the head down, lift the bum up and away from the heels. Chin is quite close to the chest. Please make sure your breath can steadily flow through. Bum comes all the way down if it lifted. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, hands to the mat. Walk the knees back an inch, tuck your toes. Lift up to downward facing dog. Pedal out your feet, bend into one knee, drop the opposite heel. Seat is the tallest point. Head relaxed in between the arms. Hands are shoulder distance, having about two to three fists between your feet. Look forward. Start to tiptoe your feet all the way to meet your hands. At the top of the mat, fold over your legs. Juicy bend in the knees, allow your upper body to be soft. Inhale, fingertips to the shins, come up halfway. Nice long spine, widen the sits bones back. Exhale, fold down over the legs. Inhale, arms all the way to the sky. Exhale, hands into the heart, and right back alongside your body. Inhale, arms reach up. Catch your left wrist with right fingertips. Side bend over to the right. Gaze under your left shoulder and armpit. Keep drawing your navel in. Have equal weight in both feet. Inhale back up. Exhale, catch the right wrist. Reach up and side bend over to the left. Peekaboo under the right shoulder. Inhale back. Exhale, fold over the legs, small bend as you bow down. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale and fold. Plant your palms, jump hoppers, step back to plank. Knees down, lower all the way to your belly. Unravel the toes, forehead to the mat, and walk your fingertips off the mat. Tend to the fingers, draw your elbows apart. Press down through your toenails and fingertips. Inhale, peel your forehead and just the tip of your heart up and away from the mat. So you can feel your side ribs still pressing down. Exhale, lower. Inhale, come up slightly brighter. Forehead, tip of the heart, maybe a little bit more. And then exhale, take it back down. One more, come up as much or as little as you like. Inhale, come up, hold at the top for three. For two. And one, lower. Take the left arm out in line with your shoulder, left ear to the mat. Place your right hand by your right shoulder. Pick the right foot up and step it behind you. Rolling onto your left side. You can bring the right hand behind the back. You could also set your left foot to the ground. Play around with the shapes that work for you. Really letting go as you fully surrender into your left side. Maybe coming back to breath work, to your intentions, to what has inspired you to say yes to jumping on your mat. Beautiful, inhale, come back to your belly. Right arm opens into your half T, right ear to the mat. Left hand by your left shoulder. Pick your left leg up. Step your left foot behind you, rolling your weight onto your right side. Take any expression, maybe close the eyes, focus on your breath. Tune into yourselves. Inhale, come back to your belly. Hands beside your side ribs. Come up, cobra. 
or upward dog. Exhale, roll over your toes, downward facing dog. Right leg lifts as you breathe in, inhale. Exhale, step the right foot through in between the hands. Rise up, high lunge, both arms to the sky. Melt into your front thigh, come tall onto your back toes. Keep drawing your belly button in. As you inhale, straighten your front leg. Exhale, bend back in, knee right over the ankle. Go two more, inhale, straighten. Exhale, bend back in. Last one, inhale, straighten. Exhale, back in. Hinge at the waist, take the arms alongside your body, spread the fingers apart, shoulders away from the ears, belly button hovers your front thigh. Keep hugging your right hip back at the same time. And then place the left hand down, left wrist in line with the right ankle, pull your right arm to the sky, twist right, elevate your back thigh. Right hand to the mat, step back, high plank. Chaturanga, knees can always come down, elbows hug the side ribs. Inhale, cobra or upward facing dog. Exhale, right over your toes, downward facing dog. For three. Two. And one, inhale, left leg lifts. Exhale, step through, high lunge. Come up tall into your back toes, arms reach to the sky. Square off your hips, draw your right heel back. Inhale with control, straighten your front leg. Exhale, lunge back in. Inhale, straighten. Exhale, bend. Last one, inhale. Exhale, bend. Hinge at the waist, arms alongside your body. Spread the fingers apart. Squeeze shoulder blades and draw your left hip back. Get long from your crown to back heel. Place the right hand down, wrist in line with left ankle. Left arm up to the sky. Twist left. Left hand to the mat. Step forwards this time and fold over the legs. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Optional back bend at the top. Hips forwards, heart up. Exhale, right back down. Inhale, half. Exhale, hands to the mat. Jump hopper, step back plank. Chaturanga. Upward dog. Downward dog. For three. Two. And one. Set the knees to the mat. Lower all the way onto your backs. Cross your right ankle over your left thigh. Flex your foot. You can place your right hand to right thigh. Press the leg away. Or lift your left leg up. Interlace your hands underneath your left hamstring. Draw your left leg in and use your right elbow to press the right thigh away. All 10 toes are to the sky. Head, shoulder blades, low back, melting to the ground. Left leg is gonna reach up. Take your fingertips behind your temples or behind the head. Full inhale. Use your exhale to crunch up towards the legs. And inhale down. Exhale, lift, and lower. Three, for four, for five. Set your feet down, and shield wiper, let that go. Left ankle crosses over right thigh, flex your foot, use your left hand to press your left thigh away. Option to lift that right leg up 90, interlace underneath your hamstring, hug your right leg in, Utilize the left elbow to press the left thigh out. Toes are to the sky, shoulders down the back. Focus on your breath, relax your face. Come back home to you.
Right leg's gonna reach all the way to the sky. Fingertips, temples are behind the head. Full breath in. Use your exhale to lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Three. Four. And five. Feet down, arms relaxed. Windshield wiper it out. Both legs lift, bend your knees. Hands to the outer edges of your feet, full happy baby. You can rock your baby. First few breaths back and forth, massage out your sacrum. And try to find stillness for just a few moments. Feeling the sensations, the space. And then kicking your feet out into your hands, taking a nice wide straddle splits. You can always switch the grass to the big toes or further down the legs to support what you need the most. Soles of the feet come to touch. Grab your ankles. Let your heels fall towards your body. Set your feet down to the earth. Arms alongside you or one on belly, one on the heart. Full inhalation through the nose. Exhale, big sigh out through the mouth. You can stay here. You're just beginning to extend the legs out for your final resting pose, your Shavasana. For the next few moments, let everything be soft, steady and still that nothing is expected of you in this time. You've already done the work. So can you bask in the stillness, in the nothingness? Let yourself rest and recharge. I'm not moving yet, but just starting to come back to my voice. Feeling the temperature on your skin, noticing any noises around you, inside the room you're in and outside. Bring each finger to touch your thumbs. Wiggle your toes. Walk the legs closer in. Reach the arms back, point your toes forwards. Big breath in through your nose. Exhale, big sigh out through the mouth. Roll over to the side of your choice. Give yourself a squeeze, a little bit of a hug. And then eventually coming all the way up to a comfortable seated position. Float your hands into your hearts. Chins are humble. Thanking yourselves for the time, the movement, the practice, the intention. 
checking in and recognizing how you're feeling now compared to when you started your practice today. Honoring the good, the bad, the in-between, but ultimately coming back home to your heart more and more. Feeling the love, the lightness, the compassion that exists inside of you. Thank yourselves for sharing breath and energy with me and anyone else practicing. The light in my heart bows down to the light within you. Thank you.